Yo, what's going on everybody out there? This is Popular Stranger and we are back today with another Madden Ultimate Team episode. I'm going to be updating my team, so showing you guys my roster. Uh, a couple changes have been made, and I thought I'd show it off now originally, and I'm kind of sad this happened. I've already recorded this video once, but something went wrong with the file, and it just would not display correctly. But the plan was to open, or I'm sorry, yeah, open up two coin packs, which I did. I didn't get anything crazy exciting. I opened up two of them and got about 10,000 coins, I think, total. Um, and uh, also complete the Rams Elite uh, collection um, to get the 95 overall Alec Ogletree. So I did that already. I recorded it, went to edit the file, and it was corrupt. So here I am recording again. Unfortunately, I can't redo those things because they already happened. Um, but one thing I did do in that episode is I did uh, show you guys my updated record. Um, so here it is, 86 and 23 overall. This is my second season in all Madden first string. And I'm off to a good start so far, 2-0. You guys saw the week one gameplay yesterday. And I just played another game and won 12 to nothing. Uh, made my opponent quit. And that's that. So four Super Bowl wins. Uh, this is my ninth season. And uh, seven playoff appearances have yet to be demoted uh, but as I stated yesterday have been struggling in first string all Madden so uh, we'll see how it goes uh, hopefully the next couple episodes will continue to be wins on this level and I'll be bringing those to you guys just a quick note uh, yesterday even though I did not record it I wasn't recording at the time this guy who was number two on the top 100 uh, list right here I actually played him DH Golden Gloves uh, he goes by the team name, I believe it was User Skills, and his name definitely justifies his skills because he was very good, especially on defense. Um, he beat me by 7, I believe the final score was 10 to 7, and, uh, or 17 to 10, I'm sorry. And uh, it came down to, I had the ball, last possession of the game, past the 50 yard line, uh, one uh, past the 50 yard line, fourth quarter, down seven, all three timeouts. Had a really nice play to T.Y. Hilton um, for about a 15, 12 to 15 yard catch. And then he just got absolutely smacked, destroyed by whoever his strong safety was. T.Y. fumbled the ball, and that was that. So I definitely had a chance to tie the game up. I probably would have went for two, honestly, because it was a dogfight the whole way, and I just didn't even want to risk going to overtime. Um, so that's that, but I looked and he had like 600 something wins and didn't feel too bad about the loss after that. Would have been really nice to beat him, but anyway, here is my team. I'll just quickly go through it. As you see, we are a 91 overall, um, uh, 91 man defense and 96 run stuff chemistry. So we are certainly getting there, um, as far as the all 99 defensive, um, chemistries you know i'm kind of breezing through this lineup real quick if you if you miss something because i'm going too fast just pause your uh pause your your video there and, and check it out but I, I more so just wanted to go through the cards each individual one not all of them but uh kind of highlight the new cards so here we go um the 96 overall fantasy kelvin johnson still here uh, i showed you guys this on my last uh update and Okay, that was strange because I just happened to flip this card and normally when a card says it's not auctionable It'll say it on the back and I thought maybe they changed something there that I could uh, Auction this card off, but then I just tried to and as you see it's just not possible uh, Mario Williams here is a brand new addition to my team. I bought this one off the auction house for about 55,000 coins uh, Jury's still out on it. Not sure how good it is all right, I'm back. You guys wouldn't have noticed it, but I had to actually <laughs> set down the controller and go do something real quick. But anyway, I'm back here. So as I was stating, the Mario Williams, uh, you know, we'll see how it goes. I I've only played a few games. Uh, here's the Alec Ogletree, the card that I completed the collection for in the video that you guys weren't able to see, unfortunately. And uh, 90 overall speed, fastest route, fastest right outside linebacker in the game. He has the plus and my man defense, which uh, helps me out. And he has some really good other uh, stats. Pursue was a 95, awareness 82 could be better, tackle 91 could be better. Um, 
uh, somebody said on the Mutt forums that his catching is in the 70s, so that's really nice. Uh, but he'll be a big part of my defense is, is the right outside linebackers who I usually use to spy on the quarterback when I'm facing those, uh, those quarterbacks that like to run a lot. Uh, Robert Quinn is another new addition to my team. I paid about 23000 for this one. A speed rusher off the right end, 86 overall speed, one of the faster right ends. It was time to get rid of Justin Smith. He was just slowing me down. A good run stopper, but I, I think this card will be better. Again, it fits both of my defensive chemistries. Still got the same LaShawn McCoy, number uh, 85 out of 100. I'm really hoping to get that 97 overall limited edition, but it's very, very rare, and I'll have to spend a lot of coin to get it. But he is my favorite player, so hopefully I can uh, go out and get that card. Not too much has changed for the cards that I'm skipping through. I did get the road to the playoffs. Dominique Rogers Cromartie, I pulled this card in a bundle topper. Again, both the defensive chemistries that I need, uh, helping me achieve that 99 and 99. And uh, I moved him to the slot, moved Stephon Gilmore out to the fourth cornerback. Uh, DRC's been making some plays. You saw in yesterday's video, I think he had an interception or two. Um, and I have some other, I have another gameplay where he got two or three interceptions in a game. Um, you know, obviously the 96 speed overall uh, helps man coverage 92, pretty decent. Uh, Quentin Copels is a new addition to the team. I pulled him last Friday when he first became uh, in packs that night. And um, I, I don't know. I, I don't know if this card will be on here. Left left outside linebacker doesn't play much for me. Um, you saw him in yesterday's video. He, he looks abnormally huge for a linebacker in this game. I think he dropped an interception in the gameplay I showed you guys yesterday. Um, and then other than that, I have Deion Jordan, the free one that they gave us all. Um, this one is just my backup right end. I, I've had this Earl Thomas, this, uh, team of the week Earl Thomas for a while. He's been in and out of my lineups. So he's just going to be my backup free safety, uh, at the moment. And Calias Campbell, another card that I've had in my, uh, reserves for a while. Just moved him to a backup. Here's, uh, my new backup running back. CJ Spillar replaced Darren Sproles with him. I pulled this card the other day. Not sure how much it's worth. It, it could be worth a couple coins, but I, I think as my number two running back, he'll fit good in my system. I had the gold version of him a while ago, um, way, way back when this all first started. Uh, he didn't do too much, so maybe this one will be a little better for me. I'm not sure. And other than that, I think the team is pretty much the same from everything else you've seen, so I'm just going through it. But anyways, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you think about my team, maybe where you think I can improve uh, specifically on defense. Again, I wish I could have completed that collection while you guys uh, were seeing, but who knows what's going on with that video file. Um, and uh, so we're, we're sitting in a good position here, 91 overall team, 334,000 coins. And uh, real quick, I'll show you guys my reserves as well. I have quite a few... Um, Hopefully I don't get the weird glitch where you're trying to search for cards and none of them show up. But uh, I have quite a few elite cards here, um, as you can see, uh, that are going to be worth some coin. I'm just kind of hanging on to them since they're out of packs now, uh, waiting to sell them. And, and so I figure I got at least 100 to 150,000 worth of coins uh, sitting in all these cards here. So once I go through and sell them all... Uh, hopefully I'll, I'll have a nice bankroll and I can go out and get some of those players this weekend, uh, like the road to the playoff Eric Berry, the road to the playoff Earl Thomas, those those cards that are expensive and, and you know, cards get a lot cheaper over the weekend. Um, so anyways, click that thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and we'll be back next week with some gameplays. And uh, make sure you subscribe because I got a feeling another giveaway is coming up and you don't want to miss it. Anyway, it's Popular Stranger. I'm out, guys. Peace.